more packages. Hello everyone, we got ourselves some brand new packages that I've been waiting for a very long time. When I mean like that, I mean a month. So for context, GCC have recently have did their little March wave with some brand new minifigures. First of all, these figures came from Tom the Builder. Go check him out. They have some great GCC stuff for all the Americans out there. And so I did buy a few from him. And of course, there's also um, Grandpa Clone Customs themselves, which I've gotten as well. They had like Wolf and Tuck, which I'm unfortunately I wasn't able to get, sadly. No! Oh my god! No! 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 First with Grandpa Clone Customs. Since this is the, the smaller one I got. Here they are. Alright, here are the GCC order I got from GCC. First thing first, we got Commander Gray, which came out at a Bad Batch. Of course, everyone else knows from him in Legends, which he had red markings, but this is the um, now canon version. Which he, he looks okay, though. Even though he's been seen like five minutes of screen time, eh, he's fine. Just wanted to collect him. Here is a um, recolor. This is the newer one. Newer stuff that came out from the um, March Wave. A um, blue version of the Shock Trooper. About the same. Here's what he looks like with the um, regular Shock Trooper. About the same here. Except the um, the one with the helmet holes. Which I do have a um, GCC Shock Trooper helmet. So yeah. Pretty cool looking. And here we have the 91st Legion Grunts. I only bought two of them, it's just so I can not feel a little too bad that I missed out on the two minifigures I did want it though. They look okay though. Now let's go with the bigger order. This is um by Tom the Builder. Okay, oh, yep. There we go. Here's the things that I got from Tom the Builder. We have the um the new World 2024 Super Battle Droid. Nothing much to say from him, but there was one more, so I got him. We have the newer stuff. Here we have are the um heavies from Battlefront 2. We have the um Coruscant Guard Heavy and the 212 Heavy. Both of them have official Lego helmets and are using official parts that they use for the um pad printed stuff. And these guys look really good. Sadly, still no printing for like the back of the um, legs, but that's fine. I'm not complaining. Here's another side by side comparison with the um, Shock Trooper and also the 212. Regular, oops, wrong one. So here they are side by side. Here is Commander Cody. Well, Imperial Commander Cody, because he was working with the Empire at the time. So he has, like, about the same, like, uniform or armor, but instead it's gray. This is the, um, official Commander Cody from the ATRT. About the same, except you can see some changes with the, the helmet. And he doesn't have his, um, jetpack... Which I don't think he really used except for the 2003 one. But you can get it like separately from like Clone Army Customs if they still have it. But yeah, this is pretty cool. He does have some arm printing, which I really wish that they gave arm printing to Cody. Even though he wasn't like, he was like in a $120 Lego set. But yeah, it's still great to have him though. Now here's one I'm very excited to have. This is Kix, the um, Clone Trooper medic that was seen in the Battle of Ambara. He looks really nice as well. I'm unsure whether this is official Lego, but um, his helmet does fit fine though. We can see the um, Menic, the Menic logo. Really nice details with him. I'm so glad I got him now. We only now I need is like one more clone left, that being Hardcase. I mean, I'm a little ups upset that. He was not like restocked with alongside with him. That would be really cool, but maybe there's still like a chance. I still have faith that would happen. 
And of course we have a um, Wolfpack Trooper. I have a lot of these. I actually bought in four. Four of them. So I do have like five more, which I bought from the other wave of GCC like around December. Now we have um, a helmet here. This is um, Captain Rex, but like an ARF Trooper. ARF Trooper. Pretty cool. Just decided I want to get him since the, the other one was like sold out a while. And finally we have some Cape Cantina. I got five of these each. This is for the um the Star Corps. And this is for um Commander Gray or Captain Gray. So we can have like the pauldron in. Let's do it right now. I'm not sure which way it goes. I'm pretty sure it's like First, this, and then we have this. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's how it goes. And we can just have it like that. So that makes them better. And here's a look at all my stuff, all in total, breaking me to over $300 worth of GCC and, of course, Cape Cantina. Love this haul. I can wait for um April when GCC is cooking up stuff. So that's all I have to say. I hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to look out for any other stuff like this in the future. And I'll see you all in the next one.